Hey everybody, how you doing? I'm HexDSL. Hi there. Hi, hello. How you doing? Hi. Um, Omnibus, right? This game's like £3.99 or something. It's like really cheap. It's been around since like, I think I want to start 2016. I can't be bothered to check. It's a Devolver Digital game that I got in some bundle at some point and literally noticed it in my Steam Lady at random recently and was like, eh, you know what? Let's try this. Go on then. Um, this game is so much fun. It really is. It's like, it's stupid. It's absolute nonsense, right? It's, um, it's, it's, there we go. Let's play that one. I've done this one already. Let's play it again. It's a good one. Um, so yeah, the, uh, the, the, the premise is that, uh, yeah, you, you should use a controller for it as well. Cause the people, they say you should use a controller, but you know, the keyboard's just fine as well. Uh, let's do this. So yeah, in this case, the bus is flying, uh, and I have to land the bus. Uh, yeah, that's, um, that's, uh, that, 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 that's what this one's about. There you go. There you go. Land the bus. Um. Oh shit! Oh 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 oh! oh. Uh, no, I failed that one. I failed it. Start again. Let's try again. Let's try again. Bus fighter plane. Okay. So uh, anyway, that one. One. Thinking hindsight, that might not be the best one. Let's do this one. Island jump. In this one, we steer the bus. We steer our bus through uh, through through this place, and we have to uh, get our bus to uh, to land exactly where 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 they want it to land. Oh shit! Okay. So a sharp turn. Oh shit! Okay, I missed I missed the jump point there. So hit B. Try again. Yeah, it's a uh, it's 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 a lot of restarting, but uh, it's just loads of like bus themed mini games that you have to like. Oh, oh. Okay, so then and then turn it. Oh shit! Oh, no, it's going it's going all wrong. It's going all wrong. It's going all wrong. Oh no! Yeah, uh, yeah. Um, I'm, I actually like played through a bunch of these last night. I had a, just a great time. I just found myself obsessively doing the same levels over and over and over. Um, oh, that's it. I've got something on the top of me. It's weighing me down. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. Let's uh, let's try it. Where's my where's my favourite one? There was one where you get to drive a bus off a building, which uh, which I really enjoyed. It was just great. There we go. Where is it? Where is it? Uh, is this it? Where is it? It's not. Is it not? Is it that one? That one. There we go. This is my favourite one. This was a lot of fun to do. Um, so yeah, you drive the bus up the building. That's it. That's the whole. That's the whole thing. So like. If you was to jump, if you was to hit one of the bouncy, there those pinball things bounce you. All the jump points there, they'll push you away from the wall. If your wheels leave the surface of the, of the building, you fall off it. Obviously, obviously, the ramps are a no-go. Also, there are cars falling. Why? I don't know. I'm, I actually like, I'm concentrating so much while I'm chatting to you guys talking about this. I'm, it's, 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 oh, fuck. It's, it's bothersome. It's bothersome. Go. Also, you can hit, if you, you can clip it when you've gone past it as well, and that's fine as well. Then we have to tight turn, tight turn. Okay, we've done this, we've done this. The camera angles don't help on purpose, because why would they? What would they give you? Oh, shit, there you go, see? And there you go, no. And now the bus falls to the ground again. Um, Yeah, good try. It wasn't a good try, I'll try again. Uh, yeah, you go from level to level, uh, and then when you've done a bunch of tasks, you don't have to do all of them, you do a bunch of them, and it'll unlock the next level. But there's more stuff. There's one where you have to rob a bank by getting enough speed up to ram the bank and then collecting money, which was stupid and fun these games four pound now i don't usually i don't like joke games as a thing i think joke like the joke games inherently aren't actually funny like the whole thing about making it like like while well, like i think uh like goat simulator is a lot of fun it's inherently a joke game right so you only get so much joy out of it before you're like yeah i've kind of explored this game did it all but this is kind of difficult in arcade -y. and i guess it's a joke game but i don't know I, I'm, I'm kind of like it i kind of having fun with it um, I played it for a couple of hours last night, like literally a couple of hours. I read it each level, probably like 30 times, some of them, just to make sure. Oh shit, see, this is no good, no good, no good. There you go, we're right, we're okay, we're okay. Yeah, nailed it. Did that a lot last night. Even I finished it, I was like, I'm gonna play it again, it's great. Boom, mission complete. Yeah, you're under arrest, haha, -ha, just kidding, good work, yeah. Um, where's the one with the robber bank? There's the, there's the bank robbery one, let's go to the bank robbery one. Bank robbery one's great. So uh, yeah, you have to, there's the bank. You have to hit that 100% speed in order to break it open and then collect the money, right? So, so what I found is if you go through this building here, boop, there you go, bank hit. There you go. And then we uh, and then we have to collect all the money. Um, there you go. Uh, the money does go up sort of at its own pace anyway. But uh, if you collect it, obviously, the more you collect, the faster it goes up. You want to avoid bouncy things. If you hit one of those pinball things, it just fucks you up. Uh, you can trash buildings as well. The buildings like kind of slow you down a tiny amount, uh, which is quite good, I think. And it seems like mailbox certain things can't be destroyed, like mailbox and stuff can't be destroyed. Um, they just get, and like uh, bins as well. Just get oh no, oh, okay, there you go. Oh shit, there was actually a bunch of money there to collect. 
stupid. Yeah, a lot of fun. Stupid. I mean, it is stupid. I mean, like, I'm not saying it's not stupid. And it's easy to dismiss it as a joke game. But yeah, it's, it's just a lot of fun. I just it, it was very enjoyable to play. And it feels kind of nice. The fact that all you do is steering left and right either. There's no control. There's no slowdown. There's no braking. It just adds... I don't even want to say to the challenge because, like, like, most of them are pretty easy, but there's a way of going about them. Like, like, the, like the bank one here, you actually have to go on the outside, avoid all the things. Just keep going on the outside because money rains down. Uh, am I going to be able to recover from this? I might recover from this. Oh, oh, oh no. One more, one more. Yeah, recover. Oh, shit. I don't know why I flipped then. I don't know why I flipped. The physics are a bit, like, are a bit janky. The physics aren't what you call, you know, sensible. Oh, shit. And if your bus gets, gets stuck on its side... Yeah, it was basically going too fast and physics stopped working. There you go. Oh, where's the... Where's the oh, shit. See, it says you go too fast. It's stupid. It's it's a silly game, but it's so much fun. Let's uh, try one of the other ones. Oh, this one was good as well. You have to, like... In this one here, you have to... Uh, you have to, like, knock the head off the statue. Is your only task. So, like, like, you can do whatever you like in this little town. You can bounce around, but you have to knock the head off that statue. There's also some bowl some some bowling you can do here. I'm sure if you hit all of them together, you get like a ten pin bowling thing. Uh, there's probably an achievement for that. And again, achievement chase is not my thing, but in a game like this, stupid pointless little tasks kind of add to it. There you go. Yeah, are we gonna do it? Yeah, nailed it. Oof, there you go. Nailed it. It was beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. Uh, omnibus, four pound ninety nine. Very 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 silly. Lots of fun. Um, I would say four pound ninety nine actually. Uh, let's uh, let's uh, let's check that because I have a feeling I'm saying four ninety nine. I think it might be less than that. You know, it's three ninety nine. Let's have a look. So, okay, so three pounds ninety nine released on the May twenty sixteen. Don't know what popped up as something I noticed in my library, but you know, at some point Steam was like, you should probably play this, and just whatever reason made me notice it. So yeah, Omnibus. I want to play more voxel mayhem destruction bus games. That's what I should do with my life. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, everybody. Omnibus really is fun. I'm not even. I'm not, it's not even something I've just like messed about with. I'm like, I've genuinely had a great time with it. It's so stupid, but like, why is it a bus? Like, it could have been a ball or a tank, but no, that was like a bus. So you know. Anyway, hexdsl. Uh, code at uk to read words I've written or patreon.com slash hexdsl if you want to help me get through get through the world without starving to death. Bye.